Hey guys, it's Hannah and I have a FabFitFun winter edit sale box to show you guys. So this is the second shop of the winter edit. So 2021, obviously. I'm going to try to go in order of what's on my invoice just to make it easier. I'm finding that that's helpful. <laughs> just keeping things in order. But there is a lot of stuff in here, so we'll try. Okay, this is first Unhive Little Marshmallow in charcoal. So this was only $15, which is a great price for these. Um, this size is usually like $23, $25. And yeah, I was happy to get this one. It's a color I do not have. I don't know why I'm so obsessed. They just have like, they're not weighted, but they're heavy enough that it's it's a little something without being like a full weighted blanket thing where you're not going to be able to get up if you wake up in the middle of the night. Like, it's not like that. Um, because I feel like that even with a 12 pound, I feel like if I wake up in the middle of the night, I feel like I can't get up. I can. It's fine. It's not that heavy. But there's like too much pressure and these are like a nice weight to give you a little something but not be crazy. Um, three boxes of these bloom organic tampons they only have their regular ones but i went ahead and bought them they're not my favorite but while i'm still i like the shape better than the rail ones um these shed a little bit so you do gotta watch out for that make sure you're not getting anything stuck where it doesn't need to be toxic shock syndrome but these were like $5.99 each. Trying to do quick math. Um, like $5.99 each, which isn't isn't terrible. There's 16 in here. I just I don't normally buy regular. I normally just buy super. Um, and these aren't my favorite. These are just ones I bought. It was convenient and. I'm going to use them until I can find another company that I like better than the Bloom or the Rayo ones. I don't like the Rayo shape. Um, I don't know. Still working on that situation. Um, okay. So this was a set of two Unhad Little Marshmallows. So these are in navy. So... These are the normal small size that they have a lot. Um, it was two for $50, which is like a regular price, but the Navy single was out of stock, and I really like Navy. It goes with so many things. Um, my bathroom is Navy, so not that I'm going to have a blanket in my bathroom, but it does kind of match what's going on here. I figured I could keep one and gift one because they are super giftable. I feel like everyone can use a good cuddly blanket. Um, I went ahead and grabbed another one of these Back Me Up charging cables. So this one's the rose gold one. Um, same thing as the one I got in the other one. So this one was $11. Was the other one $11? I feel like the other one was $9.99 or something. Well, this one was $11. Retail is $18 on these. So still, so the other one was a little bit less than half price. And this one's a little bit more. But... Or maybe the other one was $9.99. Maybe this one's only a dollar more. I don't know. Either way, it's fine. It's just to have an extra one around. And even $11 is not a terrible price. Especially these are the ones that have an outer protective layer on. And it's not just the cord. Um, so yeah. I feel like there's not a good way for me to unpack. Because this is such a big box. Um, Etitude Lyocell Bamboo Pillowcases. These are the feather white color ones. So there's two pillowcases in each of these. Um, pillowcases are super expensive just in general. I do like these. They're really nice. It says on here, it actually says the color is cloud. Um, on here on my invoice, it says feather white. So whatever. Um, so these were... 
$9.99 for a pack of two, which is not bad for pillowcases, just in general, just a pack of two, so like $5 each. Pillowcases are expensive. And I found that my skin was doing a little better when I was changing my pillowcases twice a week. I dropped down to only doing like once a week or maybe even every 12 to 10, you know, 10 to 12 days, just depending on how things are going, if I'm feeling extra tired or whatever I skip that step um you shouldn't so changing my pillowcases every three to four days makes my skin look a lot nicer just keeping extra grime from getting back on my face is helpful um I have plenty of these I shouldn't have bought these honestly I didn't need more but they're such a good price these are cheaper than I've seen them um I think I was paying like $12.99 before so I did get these three packs but I did find the last time I washed like a load one of my white ones is tearing along the seams and one of the gray ones I have is tearing along the seam in a similar place so and it's not big like I'm gonna fix it it's not a big deal but they are nice they are you know good expensive brand but I don't want to keep purchasing them if they're not gonna last and I'm gonna have to keep sewing them back together just because it's inconvenient I want something that I can purchase and it'll last and whatever yes I've had some of them for several months now I've washed them tons of times but that's not an excuse for them to be coming apart like I haven't had them that long that they should be falling apart they shouldn't be so I'm not gonna buy any more after this like for real I do like it I like them a whole lot they're awesome but if they're not gonna hold up and I'm gonna have to do work to keep them together I'm not gonna keep purchasing them obviously that's just silly um, I actually thought that I had taken this out of my cart and I didn't let me open it all the way so this is my tag alongs again um on the go mini on the move mini crossbody so this is like a velvet it has a little outside pocket it has a zipper pocket it smells like plastic um but so the inside pocket is just inside pocket there's nothing extra in there it's just whatever you can fit in there fits in there. Um, and I was going to take this out of my cart because it is velvet and I don't really want to get it in the rain. It might ruin it. I don't know. I just, what I was going to remove it from my cart. It's like a pink color. I forgot. So obviously I still bought it. It was $14, which I mean isn't bad. I can gift it to someone or whatever or I can use it at the parks so or use it on my walk or whatever. This is like a true crossbody. This is a little bit bigger than the one that I bought in the other sale. Same brand, but um, I haven't decided if I'm going to keep it or gift it yet just because I didn't mean to leave it in my cart. When I saw it, I was like, oh, that's cute. And I was like, oh, it's velvet. I probably don't really want that. It might get ruined. It's warm here, so sometimes it rains unexpectedly, even if it's just an afternoon shower. So I intended to take this out of my cart. I didn't, so here we are. <laughs> um, let's see. Three packs of the Dime Beauty power patches so these are just hydrocolloid patches like all the other ones um these have vitamin a clove oil and salicylic acid there are 48 patches in here so they have two sizes these are completely flat there's no weird shaping and these are more of a i want to say they're like a yellowy color so when i repurchased these for seven dollars a pack so 48 patches seven dollars a pack um i hadn't opened the other ones i had used yet i just was like this is a pretty good deal i'm just gonna go ahead and grab these so i have more on hand and i hadn't opened them yet so i didn't know that they were a yellowy color but 
if you have more of a yellow undertone, you could stick these all over your face and no one would even know. Like, I know the Hero Cosmetics ones are supposed to be invisible, but I can totally see them on my skin and they're clear. Um, these blend in, oh, these at least, um, equal out the redness a little bit. I don't have any on my skin right now, but if you're really red, these equal out a, the color a lot and, um... I like the two sizes that are in here. I like them a lot. So I do like these. Right now those are check. As I try more, I do have preferences for sure, but you know. Um, I also got these glowiest ASAP patches. So these also have the two sizes. There's 81 patches in here, but the small size I find is smaller than I would like it. So these were, okay, $8.99 a pack. So these cost more. Um, but there's 81 patches in here. So 81 compared to 48. I like this size better. And I like that these are flat all the way around. So I like that better. But these are much cheaper. Or like, they're cheaper per patch. So it's kind of a give and take. Um, these are not my favorite, but as far as number of patches you get for the price, these are really good. That's why I repurchased them. So I probably won't continue to repurchase these because I'm finding that I like other ones better, but for now I do have them and it's a good price. So that does play into it for me as far as what I'm willing to repurchase. These are more hydrocolloid patches. Um, these are the Zit Sticka Goo Getter Spot Clarifying Dots. So there's only 36 in each of these, but they were $5.99, $5.99 a piece, $6.99 a piece, $6.99. So these were the cheapest dollar amount per package, but there's also have the least amount of spots, but I got these because I haven't tried this brand yet. So that's why I got these. They have been in a couple of other sales. They do sell out pretty quickly. Um, so these have niacinamide, hydrocolloid dressing, salicylic acid, ascorbic acid, and tea tree oil in them. So whereas these have vitamin A and clove oil, these have tea tree oil. So good stuff. Um, these actually, this might be why I don't like these much. I don't feel like these do as much pulling. They have cellulose gum, hydronated poly. That's what this sticky, the plasticky part is made out of. Polyisobutene, styrene, isoprene copolymer, and niacinamide. So these are like very basic compared to these and even these so we'll see how I feel about these after I use them but these are more expensive so I don't know that that does play into it for me for sure and then one more thing I realized in this sale it was right before Christmas right after Christmas that some of the unhide little marshmallows were medium sized which I don't have so this one is in silver. I have the small one in silver, but look how much bigger it is in comparison. Small and a medium. I'm holding them at the same place on the bottom, but look, it's so much bigger. Um, but A, I wanted to get one of these because it's the bigger size and I have not seen these in another sale on FabFitFun ever. And by the time I realized that there were, some of these were mediums and some of these were smalls in the sale, some of the mediums were sold out. There were other shades in medium besides silver. I think there was the beige bear was in a medium and then maybe a white one. There weren't tons of options, but there were other options for this. So this was... $39. So it was significantly more expensive, but considering I have not seen them in a sale ever before or since, 
I'm glad I got one. I wouldn't go out and buy a bunch of them just because I have a bunch of the smaller ones and the small the small one is fine for a blanket for one person. It's the perfect size for one person. It's not a sharing blanket. Um, it's good to go on the back of your sofa. It's good to go across the bottom of your bed. It's good just for you to snuggle with. That being said, sometimes you want something a little bigger, something a little more cuddly, but also I live in Florida. So I don't need 8 million of these, but I'm curious to see how the weight of this size is compared to the smaller ones because I do think the size, the the weight for the smaller one is great. Um, I'm, I bet this will be like just as nice though because it's not, it's not heavy, but it gives you that little bit of pressure. So we'll see. I don't know if this size is actually going to be shareable. That's something that is still to be determined. Obviously it's still in plastic. I'm going to leave it in the plastic. I'm not opening it right now because it is 80 degrees outside. Um, I do keep it cooler than that inside, I promise. I'm not burning anybody out of my house, but I do like to be warmer, so blankets everywhere. But we'll see if this is shareable or not. But that's all. I was super excited though that they had mediums. I, I just was so excited about it because they're so expensive. I love Ellen DeGeneres. Love these blankets, but they're pricey. Um, and not everything has to be faux fur. Like, I love these. They're cuddly, but I don't just buy them because they're faux fur. Um, I like the weight. I like the size. I like that I got one for 15 bucks. And, you know, just a big fan all around. But I don't need my house to be covered in faux fur either, so... I'm not gonna buy every single color in medium. Just not gonna. They're a little too expensive for that. Um, but super excited to have this, guys. Super excited.